Sunday and picked it up. Uh, got it off the road. It was crossing the street at St. Anne's, blocking that whole intersection. We went and cleaned it up and brought it here so we could make some good wood out of it. It's uh, uh, this tree uh, was born in 1893. Uh, we counted the rings on it when we picked it up that night. What we're going to do here is we're going to mill this into dimensional lumber. Uh, uh, and hopefully we'll get some good yield out of it. It's uh, it's positioned in a way on this on the mill. Uh, we, we learned uh, we learned lumber grading this week with Jack English from the NHLA, and uh, yeah. we are uh, we're going to cut this a particular way for a reason. So I'll, I'll kind of show you what's going on here. If you imagine this log sitting on the mill like this, uh, in one axis on this log, there's a whole series of knots on both sides. So uh, what I'm doing is I want to <coughs> minimize the number of knots in my lumber, so you see the ones I'm talking about. All the way down this, there's a, it's about the same thing on the bottom, but the faces are relatively clear. I've got one on this side and one on this side. So I'm gonna have very few knots in the core of this log on the way I'm gonna cut it. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take the axis of those knots. If the knots are here and here right now on this on the sawmill, I'm gonna take my first few slab cuts here and then we're going to flip it over and I'll take the slab cuts here because those knots go in this way. So these will have a, quite a bit of knots in them, but the cant, the center of the log, um, I'll start cutting boards this direction from both sides and only a couple in the middle will end up with many knots in them. They're going to come in from the sides. So I think I'm going to get a lot better FAS yield out of this by cutting in this method. So here, let's cut this big ash log. Ha, <laughs>
going to be six and eight inch lumber. And uh, that's probably our most commonly used or needed uh, size uh, around here anyway. And so what I'm doing here is I'm bringing this down to the to the core of the tree. I'll probably come, I'm going to come down to 14 and a quarter inches. Uh, all of these pieces that we're taking back will come back up onto the saw and we're going to split these into sixes and eights. And then, uh, and, and so we can maximize what we get out of this. Uh, then when, when I get this down to 14 and a quarter, it's going to turn and stand up and all of the cuts then will be out of the log this way. And then it'll be split to a six inch and an eight inch half. And so we'll yield a whole lot of really nice boards with, with flat grain and a plain oh, sawn grain. So uh, we should see some nice lumber. This is already really promising. These knots are disappearing really quickly. So uh, we should see some really nice boards here in just a few minutes. So a couple more cuts, then we're going to sand it up. All right, here we go.
down to a point to where we won't be able to hang on to this anymore. And we can cut all the way down within an inch of this so we'll still get our final board perfect. And also, I want to turn them because as we cut, this is relieving tension and so it's kind of changing shape. We want to flip it and allow it to, to relieve on the other side of the board. Um, but yeah, I think we, we got through those nails. They're only in a few boards. And I think they're right on the edges of a couple of them, so I think we'll be fine to get those out. But, um, and the knots are looking pretty good. What's our grading looking like? Pretty good. We got a little bit here. We got a little bit of everything. We got some FAS. We got some one face. It's one count and that's two count. Okay. It's a good log run. Good, good, good. Any questions?
And that's not that you can't yeah. use that in a product, but you just for grading and figuring out what the price of the board is. Got it. Yeah. Yep. So which grade do you call that? Uh, well, you got to grade off the bad side of the board, which is okay. the less good side of the board, yeah, which is this. It's probably the one of this. Close. Close. It's on the board. It's on the front. You, you got have it here. Cut there. The good one there. You got to cut here. Probably. You, you, you got a four by. You got a four by two here. So you're pretty much missing a foot and a half here. Yeah. My belly. How can you get a one? You think you get a one? Yep. So, 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 so that means we can have uh, 50, we need 54. Let's do this and show them how it works. We, we need 54 units. Let me do one. Good job. 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 Yeah, this is the final board. Yeah. Right here. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So this, uh, so I'm going to use this, and then we'll show a little bit. So this is a 12-foot board, but it's 12-foot 8-inch. So this is, so this is a 12-foot 8-inch board, so we call it a 12-foot uh, board. Okay. Uh, so there's three 8 inches or something on there. So since the board is 6 inches wide, yep. you would use this, and without using a tape measure, this tells you that. You put it on 12. It's a, it's a six inch board, so it has a surface measure of six. So we call it, it's, it's like square footage. Got it. An eight foot board would be, if this were an eight foot, uh, you go here and then you go to this next foot over, that's a 16 foot board. This, there's not a mark for eight, so you cut right. that in half. So it's, this would be a, a surface measure of four if it were an eight foot board. Got it. So since it is surface measure six, six. we're trying to get this to be graded a number one common. It's not going to be the best grade because there's too many knots in it. But we can get a number one, I think. It might go to number two. So what we're going to do is figure out how many places we can cut this and get good, clear wood. So I know between there and there, I can't get anything. If my cuts have to be a minimum of four inches by two feet or three inches by three feet. That's what we're shooting for. So I see right here, I've got a five inch wide cut right up to the edge of that. Oh, you're close to that, sir. Let's go ahead and pull that. So this is six inches by right where those checks start. So I've got four and a half feet. So four and one half feet by six inches. 24 and half of six is three. I have 27 units right there. How many did I need? 50, 54. That's a six. So if I'm going for number one common, I'm looking for I'm sorry, 48. 48. Oh, that's right. You had it right. You'll have to get 54. I have to get 54. And that, which you're half of. Which I'm half of, but half of. these are much smaller now. So I've got two foot six here. Oh, I got one knot. Oh, wait. That's a knot. Right there. That's a knot. Are you sure it's not a little girl? <laughs> what, how about will it go out? No, it gets bigger. It gets bigger. <laughs> so really, I'm gonna get to here to here. But they have to be two foot. That has to be two foot. So we're not. Can we speak that. the two foot? Yeah, there? you got two foot. Okay. You got two foot there. Okay. You can go up. Right. So there's two That's foot. So it's two foot by six inches, which is twelve units. Then down here, I have two foot and. Three quarters, maybe. This, a lot of this, will, this will go away though. That's just that's this. Thing. That'll go away. Sure, that's clean right up. Let's see. Yeah, I think that'll clean up too. That's only. Yeah, your lumber's pretty small. Yeah. So, you've got two, two and three quarter feet by six inches. We'll just play a game. Six times two is twelve, and three quarters of six is four and a half. So we've got sixteen and a half, twelve. It's 28 and a half, 27. and 27, wow. that's 55. 55. So this board will make it. That's a number one count. You need a 54, you got one bonus here. Yeah, one bonus here. Yep. I could have measured back a little bit further that's here. That's a close one, so call it a one, that's good size. I call it a two. There you go. That's a wonderful yes. weekend. It was great. I didn't even have to help a bit, and they already got that board figured right out. Yeah. I guess well, I, did hey, my, I did my job. You did your job. <laughs> good job. <laughs>